Welcome back to Let's Play Thief. I'm Burning Dog Face. And as I was thinking that putting a poster for the watch immediately behind the toilet bucket is probably, uh, you know, asking for trouble. I have something that might interest you. Notice this poster on the wall. Degree of Containment. Or Decree of Containment. On this, the seventh day of autumn, his lordship, Baron Northcrest, has decreed that to prevent further uh, spreading of the sickness, Aldale Bridge is to be closed until further notice. Maybe I ought to get All purveyors and costermongers must cease trade immediately and return to their homes. No access is granted without a watch-issued permit. Any person or persons found upon the bridge uh, without the correct papers will be considered a thief and deal with most severely by the Thief Taker General. Scavenging, vagrancy, and other loitering near the gates will not be permitted. Keep clean and covered. By order of Baron Northcrest. Well, that worked real well. Although, in fairness, no one's going to be crossing the bridge anytime soon. Now then, we have a quest. The Point of No Return. Steal Stumblegate store loot. You wouldn't have thought it, but the shop over at Stumblegate's apparently the most dangerous place in the city. Sloop-brained novice of mine got himself killed looking for a mark. And now it's up to me to make sure they know they ain't untouchable. Steal the loot and don't die. Sound easy enough? I'm filming this on Wednesday the 19th, which means it is, of course, the the Feast of St. Mobag. <laughs> Wait. How the fuck do I get over there? Shit on a pickle. Um... It's not through there at all! Over by Ector's place. <clears throat> so, uh... In keeping with the Feast of St. Mobag, I am currently covered from head to toe in Ritual Butters. Good luck, you know. Hello? Would anyone like to try and run me through? Weird. Feels wrong to get through there so easily. I could Prince of Persia on my way over there. I was honking their horn a lot in the distance. While I'm here... <clears throat> oh, that's right. Fuck, I thought I had to, uh... push the buttons in a specific order. Shit. Hello there. My metal man's nearly complete, Master Thief. The only piece I'm missing is the engine. His heart, I guess you could call it. This device is held by a man who goes by the name Clockwise. Of course. The watchmaker. Oh. You've heard of him? But did you know Clockwise went crazy? 
The mad fool designed the heart before his mind snapped. He's turned into a hermit and locked himself in his home. That's where you'll find my metal man's heart. Finally, someone who recognizes the importance of my work. Crazy Clockwise lives in Stone Market, near Grand Martin. You'll need to break in if you're going to find my metal man's heart. What? Oh. Fuck. Okay, I guess we're doing this. You know, it's alright. Shit, I thought it was going to be one of those go to this place and start the mission things. As opposed to immediately overriding what I had already been doing. Yeah, where's that doctor's place? Seems like I need to go to the other zone. Yeah, it was up through here, I think. Is it this way? I'm doing this. Yeah, it is this place. But it's in the wrong direction. Fuck. Right? For Marco said, let me tell you what Marco Where the fuck am I going? There's Mark. Oh, there's uh, Ector's place. Weird how he doesn't pry open all of the windows. Aha! I saw that. Where the fuck am I? Shinsworth's Lane? Have I ever been here before? The time has come, brother. We return to the cathedral and on to the dawn's light. No. No, I won't go. Can you see what Orion had us do? Burn our own city. Next, it'll be cut our own throats. Spoken like the faithless. I'm sorry, brother, to see you lose your way. Oh, we've lost our way, that's for sure. I haven't been here before. There are treasures sitting on the table right next to that guy. On ground level. Oh shit! Well, that was embarrassing. How did I miss an entire zone? None of the quests brought me here? That again. The time has come, brother. We return to the cathedral and on to the dawn's light. No. No, I won't go. Can you see what Orion had us do? Burn our own city. Next, it'll be cut our own throats. Spoken like the faithless. I'm sorry, brother, to see you lose your way. Oh, we've lost our way, that's for sure. that again. 
again. It'll be fine. They'll find this guy. I'll be up here. Look at that nut or bolt or whatever that is. It was uh. Well, you know, something useful. Oh. I wonder why it does that when I look straight at it. Eat a dick. Boy, did you ever fuck up with the design of your window. Hello. Closet note. Sophia, I've left a present in the closet for you. Maybe next time you'll think twice before betraying me. Yeah, they found the body. So there's a dead guy in the closet. Bonus points if the guy in the closet is carrying a letter from Sophia, worrying that he knows. Yeah, they don't care. Dead guy, all right. Well, it's not a uh, note, but you know, I still feel clever for figuring it out. say it, but they're worse than the watch. Do you hear what they did on Market Street? You know what? I've had my fill of sorrow, so I'll pass on that story. Yeah. Here's to happier times. Oh, God. Ah! What was up with that? That was definitely a jump he could have made. Oh, I guess the problem is that he doesn't... No, he does pull himself up and run into the things. I don't know what was up with that. Annoying. Oh, that's what that is. Okay. When did I lose my throwable? Oh, that's right, I threw it at a uh, dude's head and then nothing happened. You like the darkness, do you? Never thought I'd say it, but they're worse than the watch. You hear what they did on Market Street? You know what? I've had my fill of sorrow, so I'll pass on that story. Yeah. Here's to happier times. You're blind, friend, if you think you're safe. 
Hey man, you're the one who's talking to himself. How do I get in there? That's how... I'm just floored. That there's a... a loading zone area that I've never been to before. I can't wrap my brain around that. Hmm. further down. Where the fuck am I meant to go? There? Oh. seems to hit the bottom. Foggiest light in the world. <laughs> Down you go. Out of the bottom of the stairs for me. Are you evil? No, you're just a guy. Only once. Wonder what they put in the sleep. The fuck is that about? It's got steam effects around it that can't just be a uh you know, like a seam in the world, and I'm not supposed to see. What's this? Looks like this is one of the quests, and I'm kind of already gotten sidetracked from, you know, what I was supposed to be doing. Go rob that guy too, the one I knocked out. He had a money pouch on his belt. Ooh. Oh. I forgot about that. Man, that hasn't happened in a very long time. You knock out someone sitting down so they sort of flop down onto the ground. That object to the right of my hand is clipping through the uh, thing. Here, I thought these had like stock layouts. Damn. Where's this go? Yeah, I see. 
Whether you knock down the crate and get in this way, or you have to fight this guy in order to get that. Come on, here we go. I didn't even notice that door was open-able. set of stairs. Surely if it was this foggy around the light, it should be a little foggy in the dark. Oh, there you are, my friend. I wonder this area was like, you know, before the Graven took over. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'm calling this episode right here. I'll see you next time on Let's Play Thief. Later!